Welcome back to The Sims 4 High School Years Rags to Riches. Today, I have a pretty exciting goal I wanna see if we can achieve. So I mentioned last time that I wanted to buy the Big Wallet Emporium over in Oasis Springs, a big factory lot that's about 200 grand, uh, which is great, but that's kind of a really big first step to take. So a lot of you guys were suggesting that as a stepping stone, we should buy another smaller business. And the suggestion for that was actually the weird, like non-starter home in the town here in Copperdale. So this one here, this house, uh, which I've actually turned into a retail store. I also removed a few things so it didn't just have random couches and, and stuff in there. Uh, so that's $19,500. So I wanna buy that, turn that into my own thrift store to compete with thrift tea. That's the goal. Today, anyway, that, that's today's goal, is what we're gonna try and do. And maybe also, uh, if we can make the house a little bigger, it might be good. Oh, but then am I ready to commit to no longer tiny home? That's the question. Anyway, let's uh, let's go to the toilet. Yeah, some people weren't happy with my bed choice at all. Yeah, look, I, mean, I, I agree, it's not a good bed. Like the looks of it and this room, it's all sad, okay? Look, this is racks of riches. Things start out sad, all right? I mean, we've got a ladder. We've got a ladder. We don't even have stairs, you know? Like, just, you gotta, you gotta lay off, guys. Like, yeah, I know the interior of this house is bad. It's kind of the point as well. <laughs> Stop bullying me. <laughs> I just tried to make it as good as possible. <laughs> anyway, well, let's get to sleep. We don't really need to sleep, but we might as well. All right, Kevin's back. How's Kevin doing, actually? Pretty good. We just got to do some working out. Do you want to do like a little jog? It's it's raining a little bit, but may as well do a little jog. It's a little tense from a stressful work day, but it's okay. You know, you're performing very well. It's very admirable. Can do some push-ups here. Do some sit-ups. Just trying to get the workout done. Okay, that's still not enough. Oh, hi, kid. <laughs> Hello? Wait, wait, hang on. Oh, yeah, my name's Swanson. That's right. I, wait, you, you must be like my brother, right? I assume so. <laughs> oh, that's a nice outfit. I like the shorts um, mixed with the frilly top. I guess fashion sense doesn't really run in the family. Or I guess lack thereof does. Uh, what are you doing here at 11 p.m. on a Tuesday, by the way? Does mom know you're here? I'm gonna send you home. You probably shouldn't be here. <laughs> Look, you're scared. What are you doing here? <laughs> I'm not surprised you're scared. All right, I just gotta, all right, all right, all right, Wade. You go home. I just gotta do some push-ups, okay? I said go home, I gotta do push-ups. I said I have to do push-ups! <laughs> it's midnight. I'm just gonna get my push-ups done. Oh, still not enough, come on. There we go, workout complete. All right, let's, uh, how's your needs? Needs are pretty good, actually. You wanna go to sleep? Well, Reginald's ready to get up. It's, it's, it's only 1 a.m. But uh, I guess let's start the day, let's go! Do I have work? No, today's my day off. All right, well in that case, we might as well work on other stuff. Resume writing my Reggie to riches. We, we definitely gotta get our uh, our empire going here. We gotta, we gotta start expanding. What do the upgrades on a computer do, by the way? I never do the computer upgrades. Power usage decrease, what are these? Is it just reliability or something? I don't have any of the parts, so I can't really see at the moment. I feel like it's probably not worth it though. Writing a level nine. Beautiful. Yeah, look, we've got a lot of high level skills, which is probably, oh my gosh, if we do, which is probably why I'm not I'm not too worried about soon expanding the house, like from tiny home to a regular home, because we've already made really good progress. Our little um, progress bar around this is really not changing. So I don't know if we're actually progressing with our screenplay or not. I feel like it's not supposed to take this long. <laughs> we try again. Oh, now it's like, first of all, now it's a different icon and it's like nearly done. There you go. <laughs> I don't know why this one was like a USB stick, but I couldn't do anything with it. Anyway, let's get published. Ooh, should we go to the Literary Digest? Grant a large amount of royalties which you will receive daily. This interaction can only be formed once a week. Okay, maybe not. Because also this is a screenplay, so I feel like probably shouldn't go to the Literary Digest. What should we write? We're gonna write something profound for the Literary Digest. What about a motivational book? I feel like that's, that's kind of our forte. Socially awkward? I was too. <laughs> now this is a, that's a motivational book I need to read. <laughs> All right, uh, you're scared from the thunder, so that's fine. You need to do some more knitting. I'm gonna go knit. Okay. Oh, speaking of upgrading the computer, did you save? I hope you saved. <laughs> okay, we, we saved. All right, how'd your knitting go? Was it good? <laughs> the underwear we got him in. I like how I'm just wearing a suit around the house. And he's just in his underwear. It's totally ripped. All right, let's um, clean that up too, by the way. Look, I'd love to fraternize, maybe tonight, but I just, I gotta get my motivational book out, okay? It's important. Wait, what did I want to do with Ava? Become dislike for Ava, that's right. Oh yeah, so I did move her in. Actually, someone mentioned in the comments that she may actually live in Tartosa, the world that came with my wedding stories, because there was a family called uh, Markovic there, or 
Markovic. I'm not sure how to pronounce that name, so apologies. Um, and she did live there. I could have sworn that I had separated her household into an individual one for university, but I guess I didn't. I don't think I ever made her a roommate. I thought I did, but I think I just invited her to the party. So that was my mistake. But yeah, anyway, so thank you for that. She is now living here in Copperdale with Sydney, believe it or not. They actually live, uh, it's really hard to see, but they live over here in this little starter home together. Sydney and Ava. Mm. That's some dramas. <laughs> now you go work in five hours, which you're pretty good. Do you want to do some knitting? Oh, you're inspired actually. There's... No, no, don't nap. <laughs> Knit object. Hanging plant. Ooh, yes please. Let's do one of these. This would actually be nice. You can put it up around the house. Whoa, 582 from royalties. Reggie to riches. Now that's a good royalty. Look at that, 406. Dang. Uh, yes, I like alternative music. And what is this? Uh, Reginald has reached max level writing skill. Let's go. Now do a biography. Oh, we definitely have to do a biography too. Uh oh, the baby daddy's calling. Not my baby. Oh, they clicked answer, but I guess they didn't. <laughs> the guy that has like a bajillion kids in a one bedroom house. <laughs> Wait, did I finish writing? I'm not, I wasn't actually looking. Yes, I did. Okay. We're going to have 20,000 in reserve. We're working on it. All right, this is going to go to the literary digest. Socially awkward. I was too, because I think this book, this is it. Quality is excellent too. Actually, shouldn't I get the um, reward trait that like makes written works better? Is that a thing? Uh, that makes things are crafted. Is it creative visionary? Painting and writing. Yes. 2000 points. I'll get that. Frugal, entrepreneur, promote, more likely to be promoted. We're already top of the level, so it's fine. We don't really need that. There's a lot of good stuff, but I, I kind of like going slowly. I don't need to pick out a bunch of stuff right away. All right. Hopefully the Literary Digest will love Reginald's work. Books can only be submitted once a week, but will earn a larger amount of daily royalties than publishing. So hopefully, here's hoping. That's good. All right. And uh, Kevin just finished doing a little bit of, oh, it's yeah. Summerfest. Maybe we should actually celebrate that. That'd be nice. Kevin finished his knitting, which actually, do we, is that in here? Where is it? Oh yeah, pop that in the, oh wait, hang on, that's got a glass roof. I guess we'll pop it in the living room. Uh, uh, to be honest, there's not many places to hang it. <laughs> I'll put it in the bedroom, <laughs> just there. Beautiful. <laughs> you want a massage? Yeah, let's just do it on the front porch. I did want to do it inside, but um, yeah, we don't have room inside our house for that, so. Now what do we have to do for some, we should do some Summerfest stuff. Uh, let's see, let's see. No, don't complain about Summerfest. Uh, Share Summerfest spirit. And we've got an open presence. Uh, I can't really, we don't have room for presents. I can give you, uh, I give, <laughs> I don't have any good presents. You've got a lot of nice presents. I can definitely gift you some stuff. Oops. Summerfest, I'm gonna give you a green bear beanie. That's nice. Here you go. Yay! Do that, now, does that count as opening presents? Oh no, that counted as Kevin opening presents. Okay, hang on. Let me just borrow these. Oh, I can't. Let me borrow this triangle, give it to Reginald, and then Reginald, you gift that back to Kevin. Yeah, look, we're, we're not great at holiday traditions here in the house, but, um, you know, we try. Oh, no, no, I'm trying, I'm trying to give you this little... Okay, we're going back out of the balcony. This is the only room we have. Yeah, I got this for you. I swiped it from your back pocket when you weren't looking. Actually, I swiped it from your little bum bag when you weren't looking. Hey, we've completed some affairs. Now, can we, we could do a grand meal. Can we cook a... Can, we, can you do a grand meal together? I don't think so. Just, doesn't seem like that's an option. All right, I'll cook one. I'll cook as a beautiful, wait, what time is it? Tw uh, yeah, let's do a breakfast. We'll do like a late breakfast. Now, Kevin, do these need to be watered or anything? Actually, no. I was gonna say you can go tend to this, but you can go harvest all. You can just sit here while Reggie makes a nice break. Actually, wait, when do you have work? Oh wait, no, I guess you don't have work because it's Summerfest, so probably don't actually have to go today. No, 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 don't. Hey, hey, put that back. Ah, do not touch that omelet. Do not touch that weak old omelet. No, no, no. Stop. Hello? Who are, you? Who are you? Get away. No, no, no. Don't. Stop. No. Do not eat it. Can you not literally see your boyfriend is making you a grand breakfast? And he's like, nah, I'll just get the leftover omelet. <laughs> really? Do not eat omelet. Stop. Sit. <laughs> he's literally making food right now. No. Stop. Why do you keep wanting to eat the omelet? Where are you even going? Wait, why are you going to work? Oh, okay. Great. So. I slave over a hot stove and you're like, no, nope, I'm gonna get to work. Isn't it a holiday? I can swear Summerfest is a day off. Oh, it's actually not. Huh, well, I guess more food for me. <laughs> That's kind of sad. I mean, that looks good. I guess I'll eat it myself. I guess it doesn't count as a tradition because I don't have to do like cold a meal or something. Well, that was nice. We completed it. There you go. Um, well, I guess we'll just put that in the fridge for later. In the meantime, I guess I should make some more money. 
<laughs> Let's do another uh, research paper. Let's do one on cooking, because I'm an expert chef. Should be, I'm pretty good at level nine. Like, that's pretty good. Yeah, man, this this lightning is close. Did we just get a gem? Oh, we got a, we got an element. Cry taco. Taku, I don't know. It's 120, 140 bucks, I'll take it. Sweet. Any others? <laughs> no, just a lot of mud puddles. Man, it is really coming down out here. Beautiful Christmas day, that's what I'm talking about. So I need like just under, tw or just about 20,000. Oh my gosh, my investments are not working. Actually, you guys are saying I need to actually do research stocks and then do the investment, which I didn't realize I had to do that, so I'll try that. I feel like the, the research paper is like, I guess I kind of good. I mean, it's gonna pay what, like $700 or something? Kind of good, but I feel like using this time to write books is probably better, like $770. But if I write a book, we get a few hundred every day. Which seems like a better investment of time. Let's do a mystery. Who was Lady Big Wallet? There was actually a really good suggestion that Reginald should write books about the Big Wallet family. So I feel like, let's do Who Was Lady Big Wallet? That's the first book in the series, because that's the first uh, member of our family. <laughs> So we'll work through the generations. I kind of like that idea. So we're writing this about the Get to Work series right now. It's a mystery. Because who was Lady Big Wallet? Where did she come from? It's a good question because, before, like, who was her parents, you know? Where does it stop? How are you going? You should be on the way to promotion. Yeah, nice. Oh my gosh, I'm tired. Hello? Sergio Esparza. Um, I don't, I mean, you're not Clement Frost. So to me, you're just some random guy that broke into my house through my chimney somehow. Hey man. <laughs> we do cheerful introduction? Cheerful introduction. Hey man. Whoa! We're like best friends. Now, all I gotta do is say, ask for present. Because he might give me something really good because we're good friends. Can I have a present please? I said, can I have a present please? Okay, stop writing. I have to get up for this. Present please. Hey! I didn't say you could go upstairs. Sergio! <laughs> Where are you going? Oh, we got promoted. We get to choose our branch. Bodybuilder or professional athlete? I can bodybuilder. Kind of seems what Kevin's doing. Get paid a little bit less, but kind of seems like what he's into. We're going to become a personal trainer. Promoted to personal trainer. Sweet. Well done, buddy. You are a little scared, though. How many points do we have? Oh, not a lot. Maybe I should swap over to um, bodybuilder because we're going to have to do that stuff anyway. We'll get some points for it. We'll keep doing knitting, but like just to get some points because... Being scared all the time is kind of annoying. Uh, you can go get uh, the grand breakfast if you want. Grab a serving of that. Now, can I just go get my present, please? Did Santa just say he didn't like my decor? What are you, my YouTube comments? That's rude, dude. I get it enough from the comments. I don't need it from you, too. <laughs> all right, what, what are we getting? Come on. Big money, big money, big money, big money. Is it the deed to a, my own retail store? Life under a microscope. You just buy me a microscope? <laughs> $1,600. I mean, look, I'll take it. Thanks, buddy. I guess, let, should we clear out some of this stuff? We don't need these beds. I know I kept them, but should I just get rid of them? It's a lot of money. And this desk as well, the Executron Executive Desk. Pretty sweet, but to be honest, I don't think it's gonna go in our house. Let's sell it. Oh, look at that, we got the money. <laughs> and this thing, let's keep this. This is nice, our little executive thing there. Man, some of this stuff is so expensive. Well, the business career. I like the smaller things. Oh, my nameplate doesn't fit. I'll sell it. Uh, it's got my sales award, level three of business career. Okay, that doesn't fit either. We'll keep that though. Yeah, we've got a few unlocks. High school diploma, we've got another one. Got my diplomas and achievements. Um, cool, that'll, that'll do for now. Thanks, buddy. Can I ask you for another present? Is that a thing I can do? More! <laughs> more present, please. <laughs> it's a joint household. Uh, I don't think I can ask him about more presents. Should we go say hey to Kevin? Can I like, congratulate you on your promotion? Is that something I can do? I'm gonna give you a summer first gift. I'm gonna give you my... Element I found. Here you go, buddy. Look, I found this. And sit down and have a chat. How was work? Is it good? Oh yeah, there's some guy upstairs. That's just uh, he says he's Santa, but I don't know. I've never seen him before, so I'm, I'm not too sure to be honest. I'm thinking about Summerfest together because we need to get a little bit more festive spirit going. Talk about marriage, maybe? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I just want you to complete Summerfest. Yeah, cheerful introduction to, to Santa, please. I have a present. Please, Santa. Ooh, what I get? What I get? What I get? One story of three candles. Okay. Is that, uh, all right, we completed summer first. Should we go, uh, have a little, little private time or not? Did it, did it work? I think so, maybe? Yeah, okay. Okay, you can leave now, Santa. We're gonna go upstairs, okay? <laughs> now, what was my present? Oh, Salon. Oh, there he goes. He did, he did actually leave. <laughs> oh, wait, for some reason can't seem to... A private time? Can I not get to this? No, I can. Hang on. What about now? Really? We have to get up to ask? Okay, now we can. Okay, I don't know. I don't know what happened. Whatever. Anyway, do that. We'll go to sleep and then we'll have another day of work. Get a little bit of extra cash. We'll also get the royalties from uh, the books. Hopefully my uh, literary... Did I collapse? Really? 
Dude, you're already in bed. What is wrong with you? I hate when they do that. They like get up to collapse. It's just so stupid. I'm gonna take a shower as well. Hey, 500 points. Very nice. Ah, oh, Ava's wearing a hat. Actually, we gotta go visit them. We gotta go visit them for all the dramas. Now, when do you have work again? Two days. We need to get level five charisma. We gotta practice speech. Level eight. We gotta get another four fitness points. All right, I need some workout equipment here more than just doing push-ups outside because it's not enough. Wait, why are you up? Dancing? Why don't you sleep all the way till you're like not tired? Like get full energy first. And then after you've done that, get some leftovers. So why did you get up again? You still don't have full energy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you go. You've done that. That's good. Use the toilet. Works in an hour. Fantastic. All right, should be time for work now. There we go. So he's going to go up, work hard. And if we get our performance all the way up, we can get another raise. That's what we're going to do. Get them sweet, sweet raises. All right, Reginald's off to work. Kevin, need some fitness. Well, let's, should we get some workout equipment? Might be able to fit something in here. I guess we're not really using these pots. I, look, I did plan on using them, but it didn't happen. So <laughs> might as well put something useful in here. Treadmill, maybe? Does that... Oh, no, that doesn't fit. You can't really get onto it. I guess if I do that, move that over, we can probably just get a weights machine here. Yeah, I think we should be able to use that. Good workout. Hey! <laughs> that's that's Santa. I don't know why that's so funny, like the big hat he's wearing and everything. He's like, yep, yeah, I'm off the... Wait, are you a werewolf? I mean, it's I, just because he's wearing like the werewolf clothes. That'd be so funny. <laughs> Uh-oh. Reginald has a major deadline approaching and he needs to find a way to knock it out. What should he do? Uh, ask for help hide in the closet. Well... Aren't I like the top of my career? Yeah, I guess just get help or just delegate for help. Like you don't even have to do it yourself, you know? Performance gain medium, there you go. Hey, $867 from royalties, sweet. That's pretty good, 335. It's actually less than Reggie to Riches, my screenplay, so that did better. <laughs> yeah, we need to get energized, I think. That's gonna help. Let's do a uh, brisk shower. There we go, that'll help. Yeah, look at that boost, that glowy boost. That's what we want. Yeah, Reginald's performance during the day is pretty good. Like it goes up quite a lot. Like you start in the middle and in a day or two's of work, we'll probably be getting another raise, which is awesome. Oh yeah, what's that reward uh, that, uh, is it gym rat? Build fun and don't lose hygiene. That was like so good. Yeah, let's do that. Cause then he can just keep doing this. I think I have to start over though. Like if I hang on, if I stop for a second and then do it now, we shouldn't lose. Oh, uh, hello, Santa. It's Sergio again. Why are you in my house? I think, <laughs> get out of my house, dude. Send, what are you doing? He's like, I just wanted some of your thanks for hanging out. I didn't say you could hang out. I didn't say you could walk in my front door. See you, dude. <laughs> See you next Christmas. Right. Oh, pull the muscle. Ugh. Should we go take a shower? Take a speedy shower. Will that help? How long? Four hours? Nah, you'll be fine. Showering actually does help, which is good. Oh, okay. You broke the shower. Hey, $6,700. Epic. All right. Let's use that now because now we should have... Actually, hang on. How did I go with that, by the way? Hey, we've done the next level of our reward or our aspiration. So now, not reward store, let's purchase a, our very first property, other than this house, obviously. Retail store in Copperdale. This place here, Town Square Terrace, which we're going to obviously rename it. Purchase. Yes, please. All right, and yeah, 2,500. We'll just put that in. That should be enough just to get going. Oh, yeah, here we go. I found the comment. There was, there was like a, a name that I really liked. It was called Big Wallet Boba and Bargains. Now, obviously, we can... First of all, that name's great. Thank you. Thank you so much for that. Um, now, obviously, we can't actually have a thrift store in the sense of the way it works in the rest of the game. Though, I feel like, what if I just put these in my store? Now, I don't have a lot of money, so... I'm, can that really not go there? I don't have a lot of money, so I'm not going to buy a whole bunch of these. If I put that there, can I thrift on this? I can. So we should still have, if we open this up, probably, people will probably still come and probably still use these to thrift. So I think we should definitely still try it. Um, Now the boba tea like bar, is that something I can actually just put on this lot as well? And can I just hire someone to work at it? So we got the thrift tea bubble tea counter. Uh, By the way, we'll, we'll, we'll obviously renovate and change all this. I might put it back here for now in like the kitchen area. Which, by the way, I think let's, uh, we might use the upstairs as an apartment. That's why I've left stuff up here. So I might, I'm just gonna put that in my inventory for now and I'll, I'll figure that out later. I just wanna see if this works. So now, can I like hire someone to work here? I can, hello. Or we can tend it. So we could kind of still have a thrift store and we can still make money because with retail, you can actually sell outfits by using mannequins. So we could get a few mannequins in here, have a few looks on it. Man, these are expensive. So for now, we get like one, oh, so one of each age and style. Yeah, let me just do another little bit of money. There we go. So then I think what I do, I can, to be honest, I don't know how this works. Let's, I guess, well, first of all, let me hit save. <laughs> then we say, 
Create an outfit, create random outfit. Let's just try that because I don't want to spend a bunch of time creating stuff. I want to see how this works. Let's do uh, every day. I'm sure this is going to be wonderful. So we'll just unpause, let him come in here and do that. All right. No, I mean, that's not terrible. Um, can I, I thought you could sell this or am I making that up? What was the point of mannequins in this game? Do I make money from this? Okay, this could be a problem. We might have to sell some other stuff. <laughs> I thought I could sell these. Wait, I've got like the tag. See when I click it, it's got the little tag icon. So I think it is, I, th I think it is for sale. I think. Let's just, we're gonna test this. <laughs> this is a random everyday outfits on all of these. They're yeah, beautiful. These are just, now that's a thrift store. So if I just say open, store is open, uh, that's good. Let's hire, let's get a boba tea vendor. I just wanna see how this works. All right. Welcome, come one, come all. Hello, loiterer. Would you like to <laughs> sign autograph? Great customer. Hello, welcome. Would you like an autograph? Yeah, I'll give you. I'll give you an autograph. Like, who are you? <laughs> Reginald. Reginald Big Wallet. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they seem pretty happy about it. They are. <laughs> Enjoy. Hello, welcome. Ah, uh, Jane Laurent. It's a question. I mean, they seem like they're looking at the mannequin. Oh wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Wait, I can purchase. Oh, I see. So I can only purchase outfits that would fit. Me, okay. So that, all right, that's how that works. Now, the other question is, yes, they can purchase the outfit, but do I get the money for this? Or does it just disappear? Because sometimes things in this game, as you all know, don't really work how you think they'd work. So I'm curious to see if this bar fills and then they buy something if I get the money. That's a question. Hello, great customer. Hey guys, I just we just need to get at least one sale. Now, I know we've done so much retail in all of my um, like Let's Plays. I don't want to spend a huge amount of time in this let's play dedicated to this store like when this is not going to be a source of income this is kind of just a little bit of fun to side thing i think we cool to come here every so often but not really like i don't want to be micromanaging sales and all that you know i also want to see if anyone buys boba tea because that would be nice and i would love to just like deck this place out and make it really cool so that's kind of the plan and then obviously earn money to buy the other one too i think they just tried the outfit but i was fast forwarding so i didn't see it oh i'm going to the toilet see you guys anyone want to get boba tea i did hire a vendor oh Okay, they just tried the outfit, but I, I don't think I see it. Alright, let's close the deal. I'm very confident. I'm a top level businessman. I can close this deal. You, yeah, you want this outfit. You really, really want it. You're gonna love it. Yeah, we work it. Work it. It's gonna suit you so well. It's beautiful. Oh, yes, he's trying the outfit. Look at him go. Yeah, you like that? You like the orange pants? With the... Oh, you do like it. There you go. Okay, that actually did work. I didn't fully close the deal, but you're very close to buying something. Oh, she's trying the outfit. Yeah, you like that? You, you like it? You want to buy it? Yeah, I think you do. Yes, what choice? What value? Ring up customer. All right, how much do I actually get from this? A few hundred bucks. I mean, this one was like, what, 218? All right, don't worry. I'll get this outfit going for you. No worries. There we are. Yeah! We're rich! Uh, you wanna be best friends? Hey, well, you're my customer. It's against retail customer uh, policies. I can't be friends with you outside of work, sorry. <laughs> restock for 175, so we sold it for 218. Okay, well, let's restock the outfit. All right, cool, this works, this works. This is, this is a little side project that we will work toward, but let's close it out. We made $43. No one bought boba tea though. I don't think that really works. So we might just have to have the boba tea there for like, for show, but not really use it. All right, that's awesome. So we own that. We'll work on making that look sweet. It's gonna, it's gonna, we're gonna take down thrifty. Thrifty, pff, thrift who? Or like it? <laughs> All right, I'm exhausted. Let's go hit the hay. There you go. Oh, let's shout, hang on. Okay, no, go fix the shower. <laughs> Kevin, how's your muscle? Time to work out. No eating, it's workout time. <laughs> you're a bodybuilder now, that's literally what you have to do. All right, you're asleep, shower's fixed, awesome. So I have to be level eight. Oh, I just have to do mentorships. Just in general. I guess I can mentor Reginald because, you know, he's kind of lost his way. Since he went corporate, he kind of lost his way with fitness. So maybe we can work on that. I, I, we're not going to do it before tomorrow's work, but, you know. Right, let's just get one more. Oh, okay. Let's get one more skill. Never mind. <laughs> let's get to bed. Sleeping. Oh, okay. I guess Reginald's up. <laughs> Let me scavenge parts real quick. And I think I need to upgrade the shower. Can I just do all the upgrades real quick? Okay, second upgrade. Water flow regulator. That's the one. That increases shower times even more, which we already did some shower time increasing. So let's do that again. All right, so wait, what upgrades are left? Water recycler, water utility is decreased. I don't like reliability, but anyway, let's take a shower. So this shower now should be like really quick, right? Stop getting glasses of water. Oh yeah, look at the shower go. Regular speed, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, gosh, those glasses. All right, let's go get some food. <laughs> Don't worry about it, it's fine. I got, oh no, Kevin's got work in an hour. 
Which is good, he's kind of awake anyway. Looking ripped. All right, so you gotta go to work. All right, whoa. <laughs> he's like, so he's like more ripped than normal. I guess that's what working out like 24 hours a day does. All right, should we clean this up a little bit? It's a little messy. Yeah, there you go. All right, so I'm off to work as well. All right, so hopefully I can get a, uh, not a promotion, but a raise today because our performance is looking great. 927 from royalties, let's go, I think. Yeah, there it is. Very nice. All right, back with 329, not too shabby. You're a little tense, do you wanna go work out? That'll be fun. <laughs> he's come back from a day of like the gym and he's like, yeah, I gotta work out. My life is working out. I mean, it is fun to be fair, so he does actually enjoy it. How are you going? Ooh, yes, we should actually get a raise today. We're 838, 858, let's go! And a raise. More money, more money, more money. Now, I gotta go visit Ava. Hey, Kev. Uh, cause that's one of my things I gotta do. Jog here. You know what? I will jog here. Cause I do need a- okay, I said jog. Okay, okay. All right. Yep, I said jog, but you-, you that's the third time you've got on your bike. Hey mom. Uh, okay, you're still getting on and off your bike over and over again. I'm literally not doing anything. I just clicked on the house, I said jog here, and this is the result. Okay, let's just use the map. <laughs> I thought maybe let's go for a happy little jog, but no, no. He just got stuck in a bike loop. <laughs> Oh, hey, Sydney. Do you want an autograph? <laughs> I actually really want to give an autograph. Can I do that? Because I feel like it's so... Wait, where is autograph? Can I give you an autograph? What the heck? I just want to give you an autograph because I'm famous. <laughs> I couldn't see an option. I knock on door. Hey, Sydney. Did I actually come to see Ava? Not you. Is she here? Oh, yeah. Hey. What's up? Smooth apology. I'm sorry. Wait, is smooth the friendly option? Because I think smooth recovery is a romantic one, right? Yeah, smooth apology is unfriendly. Okay, good. I don't know why she's standing in the corner, it's kind of weird, but sure. Hello? Smooth apology. Hey, I'm so sorry that you bullied me in high school. Um, it was kind of your fault, not mine, but you know, let's let bygones be bygones. I also- oh, I'll compliment you. You got a lovely house. You got a-, you got a okay, what are you doing? Do an impression, really? Th why? Why would you do that? You got a wonderful house, I actually really, really like it. Um, also, if you want an autograph, I'm happy to do that for you. I just gotta find the option for it. I'm gonna humble brag a little bit. Yep, yeah, I just bought a business downtown. <clears throat> yep, I own my own house and uh, top of the- Hey! Hey! Yep, I uh... Oh! <laughs> Sydney! <laughs> what are you doing? You know what? I'm not even gonna- I'm not gonna- If- if this happens, it's not my fault. I'm just- let's just let this play out. Let's see what happens. Is he gonna- is he gonna sort it out? There's a fire alarm. I've run out of the house like a big hero that I am. Okay, Sydney is still on fire. The firemen are out here just nodding their heads, not really doing anything. Okay, he's not on fire anymore. That's good. Okay, he's alive. Uh, oh wait, the fire's out? Wait, what happened? Oh, I think they put it out from outside. Um, alright. <laughs> anyway, where were we? <laughs> Oh gosh. What am I trying to do? I'm trying to get her to like dislike me, so not hate me. Now like, apparently yeah, likes and dislikes is where get to know is now. So thanks for that. I, I didn't realize that that was moved. Gloomy. Okay, well that explains you bullying all the time. Um, I will also just quickly brag about my job. What is my job again? I'm an angel investor. I have so much money, I just invest. Pretty epic. Okay, I probably shouldn't brag to be honest. Okay, I'll be friendly. I'll ask about your day. I just feel like we should- okay. Uh. Uh, what was that? What was that? Uh, why did I have like a creepy like out-of-body experience? What happened? <laughs> I'm scared. I do have one question for you though before I go. <laughs> before my out-of-body experience ends my life. Are you single? Not for me, I'm just curious. So uh, what's it like being roommates with uh, Sydney? My ex, yeah, he's you on the date. And I'm seeing someone, let's go! Is it Sydney? I wonder what he's thinking at this point. You know, like we're in his house. <laughs> Not even talking to him at all. Also, you just started a fire and burnt half your kitchen, which quite frankly is kind of embarrassing for you. I don't know why I'm the one embarrassed, to be honest. Shut down. Oh, is this what that was? Is this what that, uh, that out-of-body experience was? That I was shut down. The danger of bragging is that you might be talking to someone who doesn't think you're quite as cool as you do. I mean, I'm pretty cool, so <laughs> that is wrong. All right, let's go home. I gotta get out of here. See you later, losers. Enjoy your burnt kitchen. All right. Hey, Kev. Oh, actually, what I would like to do, if I go work out, can you come mentor me? How do I do it? Uh, fire up. Wait, how do I do this? Mental fitness. Okay, it doesn't tell me. Because normally, don't you have to be at the top of a skill to be able to mentor? Oh, do I need to get the mentor thing? Uh, I thought it was something, it was like a reward, or you have to be the top of the skill or something, right? Yeah, mentor. Once mentors reach level 10, they can mentor soon. So do I have to get that and be level 10 before I can do my that can't That can't be right. Ah, oh, propose! Uh, no, I don't want to do that. 
Not right now, anyway. <laughs> what if I just say fire up? Where did that go? Fire up. Maybe that counts. Okay, I fired you up. I don't think that helped. <laughs> ah, get to know banter. I feel like I can't mentor you, but anyway. What if I click on the machine? No. Make a flirtatious joke. Maybe that'll help. <laughs> Maybe that'll help somehow. Hey, level nine fitness. Let's go. Okay. Uh, he's just given up and gone to bed. <laughs> All, right. All right, let's go to the toilet. Oh gosh, this bathroom. I don't think I can clean up this stuff because they can't take uh, trash downstairs, oh, down a ladder. So I think I have to drag it manually and then they can clean it up down here. And then I can say throw away and like clean up and all that. There we go. That's better. And can you repair that too, please? Okay. And I guess repair that. All right. And go to bed. Sleeping. All right. Well, I didn't get around to expanding the house, but now that we've got that business, um, like that's good. We've sort of taken that money out. We've got 11,000 left. Oh, actually speaking of 11,000 left, before I end up today, I would like to go web research stocks let's do that first this time all right there are research stocks then now if i invest will that help five thousand dollars let's go i guess we'll find out next time <laughs> i don't know if i have to do it multiple times or what <laughs> Ew, that toilet's nasty hey kev oh i was gonna say you want to woohoo like old times but it didn't work so never mind i'm gonna bed <laughs> I'm too tired for this anyway. Um, can you go clean the toilet, please? Dislikes dancing. Sure, there you go. Now, do I still need skill for work? I do actually need one more level. Let's do enraged reps. I know I was supposed to be finishing. I think I was just wrapping up, but we can't be that far off, are we? No, we're pretty close to getting the next skill. Oh, I've got work like right now. Uh, chat with Masaru. You want to talk with a firefighter? Why? Do you have a thing for him? Oh my god, you are actually so... I know he was ripped before, but like, kind of looks ridiculous. All right, well, he's off to work. I'm going to leave this part here because I think we did achieve what I wanted to today, which was to get that thrift store, or I guess our clothing store, which again, is not going to really make any money. It's more just for a bit of fun and a bit of the story. Um, and soon, I, I think I want to expand this house a little bit first, make it, you know, a proper home, a little bit bigger, you know, so we can actually do interactions inside the house. Then I think I'll look into, we'll probably do a proposal, marriage, adopt some kids, raise that generation. That'll all be probably pretty soon because as I mentioned before, this let's play, we're going to progress there. We're going to have the kids and then Reginald's kids are also going to have kids, hopefully all within this let's play. I mean, we'll see how we go for time, really. I don't, I don't want to like rush anything, but I also don't want to drag anything out. So we've got a lot of little things to do, you know, including raising the kids, having more grandkids and all that kind of stuff. So... There's a lot of like beats to hit. So we'll look into that soon. Hopefully expand this house. We're making really good money. So I think that shouldn't be too hard to do and then grow the family. But until then, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day. Oh, and I can't wait for Sydney and Ava to have kids and then their kids and my kids go to high school at the same time. Ooh, it's like a Montague and Capulet kind of situation.